Welcome back to Cottrell's Hunting and Trapping Outdoors. Uh, I'm up here at the farm here tonight, and what I'm getting ready to do, I'm going to put a couple, I call them bait holes. Uh, I don't know if what you all call them, but that's what I call them, and I'm going to put them in, and I'll tell you the reason why I am. I have my trail camera right down there on that tree right there by the road. Well, the coyotes are coming up that dirt road right there from up that way. They're coming down and coming up our lane right here and coming up through here, up this gravel road here and going up through here and going back into our hollow right there. So I decided I would bring me some bait up here and put me a bait, couple bait holes in and see if them things are going to hit this or not. And what I'm going to do, why I picked this location right here, we're right in a turn right here. And I don't know if them coyotes are going up across the face of this pond right here. I'm going to say they probably do travel across the face of that pond, but I'm going to try to see where they're coming in here at and see if they hit that bait or not. And if they do, then I'm going to be betting me a couple traps up here. But what they're doing, like I said, they're coming right down that there gravel road or, or up that gravel road right here and then coming up this lane right here. <clears throat> I would try to uh, set them traps right off this road, but uh, I can't drive a stake in here. But I'm gonna try to figure something out. I might chain a trap off to either one of them posts right there and try to see if I can catch anything there. But I'm gonna put me a bait hole right here and I will let you all see this after I'm done with it. But if I was going to set this up, and let me make that clear, because season isn't in here yet in West Virginia, let me make this clear. This is a bait hole. There isn't no trap in there. I dug a trap bed out like if I was going to set my trap right there. But this is a bait hole, and what I'm doing is seeing if these coyotes are going to hit this because uh, like I said there earlier, if they start hitting this, then what I will do where I dug that little indentation out right here is where I'll put my trap in. And the uh, thing that I would do if I was going to set a trap in here I would hug that hole. That's how I set my traps. I, I put my trap just right up on the hole. And uh, that's how I would set it. But anyhow, what I did, I just made a dirt hole here. And I put uh, some bait down in there. And I put a little bit of lure down in there. And then I put that rock over it. And that's a little bit of red fox urine that I had that I put on that and I just set this up just like if, if I had a trap set there but there isn't no trap in there so what I'm going to do I'm going to see if they're hitting this and I'll be able to tell if they get in there uh, anybody that has done this trapping can tell when a coyote's full with their sets but uh, you can this is just what I'm trying this year, and what I'm going to do, I'm going to go right back down this road right here, and about where that uh, is a rolling right there, I'm going to set one right off, right on the side of the road there, and then I might do one right, right down there by that pole, if, if you can see that from here. But what I am doing, I'm setting bait holes up here. So uh, I will get off here and uh, I will see you a little bit later.
I'm going to put another one of them bait holes right here. And the reason why I picked this, and this is just, man, I could be totally wrong here. Don't, don't take my word for it because I'm not, I'm not a, I've been trapping for five years and caught one coyote. But this is what I would do if I was going to set this up. Them coyotes, like I said, are coming off that road right there, that dirt road right there. And they're coming right up through here. Well, you take a coyote coming up this road right here, he's going to notice these here rocks right here. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to put a hole right there under them rocks, right at the corner of that, and I'll see if they hit that. But that's why, why I picked that out. And that's probably all I'm going to do here. But what I'm doing, this is some of the preseason stuff that I do sometimes to, to see if anything's going to hit this. But there's a house right down that road right here. There's a house. And then from, from that house on up through this road right here, Nobody lives up this way. And uh, them coyotes, they just run all over this place up here. But uh, honestly, I think they come out of over there too and they come down this road. I've gotten them, like I said, I've gotten them on my trail camera there and that's why I'm going to try this. And uh, another reason why I'm going to try this is because uh, I haven't been seeing many deer up in the hollow up there and uh we've got to do something to get these coyotes in check and not only that that little dog right over there my little dog i take him out a good bit up here and uh i'd hate for a coyote to get him but uh anyhow i'll get off here and i will end this video i'll put this bait hole in and then i'll show you what i did there Anyhow, I'm done here, and this is my second bait hole that I put in, and yeah, I put a little bit, of, I put a little rock right there, and uh, that's the second one I put in, but that's how I do it, and what I've got for them are Duke 175s that I've run. I bought me a cookie cutter off of Trapping Time, and uh, I use a cookie cutter and what I did, I dug that out in the shape of what my trap is. And if something gets a hit in that, I will drop a trap in here and put my trap in there. But this is just trapping prep is I guess what you'd call it. But uh, I put this one here and then up on that point up there, I don't know if you can see it up there. But there's a rock right up there. And uh, there's another bait hole up there. But anyhow, I'll get off here. It's just a small video of how I do things. And uh, I thought I would come up here and throw a couple of these in here tonight. And like I said, our season doesn't come in till the 7th of November here. But I just want to see if these coyotes are traveling up through here. And what I'm probably going to do is come up here and put me a trail camera up on one of them posts up there and see if they are coming up this road. But anyhow, I will get off here. And I hope you enjoyed this video. If you want to watch it, watch it. I hope you've made it this far. If you did watch it, and I will get off here. I just wanted to throw something out there for you all and put something out there. But uh, this is what I do to get ready for trapping season. So I will get off here. Y'all have a great evening. And I hope the good Lord has blessed you wherever you are today. I know he has me. And he got me up out of bed and he let me see another day. And I have been blessed. But I will get off here and I will see y'all on the next one. I Really appreciate each and every one of you that have subscribed to my channel. And 
I thank you all for that. Y'all have a great evening, and I will see you later.